is a fourth down and inches. We get a QB sneak here. And that's what they try to do, and the Dukes try to repel it. But again, the surge, oh, and no, did the Dukes come up over. with the football? It appears they do. The upside, and you've got Paul Kier on the near side. Handoff is to Van Horst. Over to the 20, shows some patience, gets around the corner, and then heads out of bounds. Inside the 15, he's marked out, pushing the football. And no better place to be physical than in the red zone. They're going to throw into the red zone, and it is caught. Touchdown, Ravenel. Devin Ravenel with the score, and JMU does strike first, taking advantage of a miscue with the pursuit. Watch Carter here. you got to get it out of bounds. You get it out of bounds, and Gallant did not do that. He just left it up for grabs. Absolutely. Sometimes in that situation, a sack isn't bad. Hershey is a Obese in the backfield with him. Now Danucci takes it right up the middle. He's got the first down and more. Gets an inside seam block, and he is out at the four-yard line. Just shy of the goal line, an eye formation again. They hand off, and into the end zone is goes Percy Ajay Obese, and you can say touchdown for number 31. The football. And here comes the sack. And driven down the tackle, the sack for the Dukes of James Madison, Mike Green. Right to the line of scrimmage. Danucci surveys, and he's going to go deep. He's got a man open. It is caught. Touchdown, James Madison. It is Brandon Polk with the score. Danucci, Hamilton in the backfield. Danucci's going to throw it to Hamilton, who comes out of the backfield, right up the seam, cuts it to the middle, heads to the... Far hash, and he's on his way into the end zone. Touchdown, James Madison. Just a short flare pass, and Hamilton does the work from there. It's Danucci again. He's going to float it in towards the end zone. Touchdown, Solomon Van Horse with the reception. We do have to kick off. And the Dukes will get the football to start the second half. It is Hamilton. He's going to find a seam up the lane. There he goes on the far hash mark. He re Eludes a couple of tacklers and is dropped down at the 35-yard line. This time they're going to go to Percy Ajay Obisay. Bounces outside, oh. and he will tiptoe into the end zone. A touchdown for the Dukes, and a few more streamers get to soar here at Bridgeport Stadium. Guards, wait a minute, supposed to be going the other way. Lofting it out, looking for the touchdown, and there's a compete score if they call it. Yes, it is a touchdown for James Madison. A nice six field goals. Furman has a, a one-man kicker, too. Uh, and the Dukes will pick it up and take it to the house. It's one of those days for the JMU Dukes. And it is blocked. The Dukes recover. They can score it if they take it all the way to the other end. Stepping inside, and let's see who picks it up for JMU. Looks like they're going to pass it underneath. This time it is a touchdown for the Dukes. And this time, Eric Curlew coming out of the backfield.